Good day everyone and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. We strongly recommend to stay on a sim as long as needed before you start going live. We show the same time frame every day, not uh, one day rank bar or tick charts or we, s we show a different variety of uh, uh, time frame and we use the same charts every single day and uh, we we show some of the results uh, i want to start i have only one chart is traded non-stop and today nailed 2300 and now it just finished it made 288750 uh, i just want to give an idea for the traders uh, when they are a trade and sometimes you make much more than that this is an example here and then the market gets flat and once the market gets flat you don't make money so the idea about 24 7 uh, you really have to know or to be trained properly before you can do that or you can use a higher time frame for that today sadly the the gold you have to see the good and the bad the gold didn't do well mm -hmm. today and uh, uh, which is on a very serious time frame the 370 and all what i can say welcome to trading you know but it needs to be adjusted because it was almost one thousand dollar and uh, i didn't have the trading stop with it just the break even but um, that's how it is so you can see today the the gold got brutal uh, in there uh, another uh, the DAX today uh, 1200 also it was a very small trades for the four minutes chart uh, the nine range is only two trades you know because it's a bigger time frame so you can see the difference between five minutes and the nine range is totally different and uh, so it is a bigger time frame so it's a less trade and less a, a volatile uh 45 seconds they all started around 9 35 uh 1600 small trade small trade and when the market despite the feds were talking today we survived the feds today this is very important on the es three minutes we got three thousand one two three and it was done uh on the es 10 second is my favorite uh for a guy cannot see when the market like this one here, this area here. This is not good for auto trading here. And um, when it's, it is 10 seconds, you, you get some movement. And that's what we are looking for, for movement. And it hit it. And if we look at uh, the timing, uh, mm -hmm. was perfect on that one here. Uh, the YM 24 second, 1300. Uh, YM two minutes eleven hundred, YM five minutes twenty two hundred, uh, ES twenty five second. Also, you can see uh, one thousand and uh, the five hundred tick Nasdaq. This one here, I always highlight on every single video, uh, the five hundred ninety ticks, and uh, you can see where it started. It started the first trade around nine fifty and took one two trade and then 23 20 and uh, i highlight that on every single video the 590 takes and it is very uh, here it is i mean i have not done any adjustment uh, on this one i can even get it better than that uh, i have not done any adjustment uh, for three months now and uh, it's working so i don't want to ruin it i'm keeping it uh, 20 second CL, uh, also one and two, uh, 1460, the NASDAQ three minutes, 3,500. And uh, all of them are on $1,000 uh, target, but when the market go into your direction, it's not gonna stop. The YM 230 takes, it was not even one losing trade on the YM 230 uh no actually i'm sorry there is a couple losing trades and then it is in a scalping mood and then took that trades this is very good 
Uh, this is one auto trade, and uh, we are going to cover another auto trade. We're gonna cover the scalper. Uh, the scalper also is a very friendly use, and uh, today I'm testing small ticks and uh, very small ticks. I'm testing it, and then, um, and uh, I'm I'm trying to to see. So I'm testing this one here. You can see how uh, this uh, three, four takes, five takes, break even, close. Three, four takes, break even, and close. So this is what I'm doing here. I'm testing on this one here. And uh, you can see one, two trade. This one here took a lot of trades, the one minute. Took uh, really, it was a little bit chop at the beginning. And then the last three day uh, trades did the, the trick and this is uh, the scalper on the next generation this is a really advanced automated trade and um, on the five minutes today it did not hit the target will come to trade and nothing can be done uh, did not it did not hit uh, the trade uh, did not hit the target today and uh, nothing can be done about that uh, will come to trade in and you can see also there is a small trades in there, here and there, because the bars are big. And uh, this is when the feds were talking, you know. And on the full range, it was a total different story on the full range. Broke even, broke even, and then took one trade, is finished at 13.62. And also, I mean, we show the ES and sometimes NASDAQ, but you can use this auto trade on any given uh, market. Should not be just ES, but that's how it is. And... Um, the difference between uh, the range also I forgot to show you the range on the precision auto trade also uh, it does a good job if we I didn't show that uh, the the I took a one time trade and then it is done on uh, there is a lot of uh, people like uh, range trade so and uh, there is there is a good feeling on the uh, on, on the range uh, nothing wrong with it you just need to know how to play the game in the market that's it uh, we will uh, show the last one the reason today the ti7 has outperformed the other uh, auto trades and uh, here what it is uh, because the ti7 has a huge variety serious filters and when the feds talk, uh, there is a lot of traders, they sit on the side, they don't want to trade on that day. Some of the traders, they wait till the feds talk. And uh, for the ones, um, they know the trick, you know, one word can take the market up and one word can take the market down. So there is a lot of traders, they, uh, they sit on the side. And then the market gets nervous on that day. So, uh, and then it gets flat before the Fed stock. Um, and and the reason the the TI seven has outperformed the others because of the filters, and and uh, 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 there is a pinpoint filters in there, where you can uh, filter all the noises in the market, or you can avoid trading when there is a, a sideway market but uh, this is an example here i want to show because today is a little bit different than a normal day it was a lot of brutal uh, losing trades this one here has no filter and you can see it's still struggling and now on the last trade finally uh, made a 2100 and probably is going to close around 3000 on that trade if you look at the charts Plus he made 862, so that will be close in this one here. Or you can do like this, close position, we close position, and it is 3,262. So this is one thing. And um, uh, on this one here, uh, the, the, the Russell, uh, three minutes, did very well, and actually didn't have any losing trades. Uh, and it is a really consistent on the Russell. I don't trade the Russell, but 1720 on the Russell. 
uh, Nasdaq four minutes somehow on that auto trade the four minutes is and you can see how many small trades as well and and but I survive it and I made 1000 and you can see there is more trades than normal and because of this volatility today and fats so this is the gold if you notice on the uh, on the uh, precision auto trade did not finish uh, the the target where on the gold hit the target and the reason is because we are filtering on the uh, on this one here filtering uh, noises and um, uh, on the other one the precision auto trade does not require any filter because the entry was superb and this is another example this is a mid-size eight range chart and I want to just mention to you how uh, when the market when, when you sit when you set your target very high uh, what happened you generate uh, a lot of uh, trades and we started today around 9 35 so it is here somewhere around there uh, we we took the first trade is right there so we took one trade two trade three trade and four trade and it was done because they all started around 9 30 and um, and um, it was 2380 so what I'm saying is if you are let's say trading one contract uh, on the YM or on the ES you cannot set it to thousand dollar because what it what it what it does is gonna make this is before we started today it's gonna make a trade lose a trade make a trade you know you just going in the circle and 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 uh, but once this market spikes because normally the market spikes once a day once we catch the the, the spike for today there is no use anymore to deal with the market so if we look you know it's common sense if you look I mean we missed a little bit here because of the trillion stop but then here before Alan uh, before the feds start talking and then the market start going up but anyway you should walk away actually I had a, a one guy having a problem today I was talking to he is a good uh, trader uh, but he he don't know how to stop he had 30 winning days and yesterday he got aggressive and got whacked and he got very pissed he said because he had 30 winning days non-stop and then yesterday the the uh, you know we all are human I don't blame him but um, he got a little bit over aggressive and uh, he paid the price immediately and it's not the money because that can indicate what kind of person he is because if he can be consistent for 30 days this is excellent because on a normal uh, uh, guy even including myself no exception if you have one losing day a week you are okay you know and this guy made 30 days consistency with a profit and then he got very comfortable yesterday and the market whacked him so you never can turn around on the market uh, CL 13 range I need to make a new uh, more CL charts uh, YM uh, 5 minutes 1660 they're all on 1000 um, uh, this one here the Russell again 1730 ES three minutes this is fair enough uh, I like that because it didn't take that many trade one and two and it was done finished I like that and then uh, we have the ES five minutes uh, the CL five minutes and the one minute and actually today the one minute did very well and uh, you can you can see we started around 935 took one trade two the feds were talking I didn't want to mess with it and it was done nice and easy so if we want to compare that to the other uh, charts you can see uh, when you have a, an auto trade going non-stop in a way you start going in a circle uh, ES three minutes did very well 
and uh, a YM595, we always show this one here, 265. And you know, this is again the range. Uh, this is uh, the gold range. And uh, you can see it was consistent, better than the precision auto trade, uh, taking left and right because we are using filter. And what, what I mean by filter, if somebody, if you notice here, uh, the the this hard area here is a losing area for any kind of auto trade and when the market is start trending the filter has avoided those area here when you put too much filter sometimes you don't get an early entry you get a late entry but it gets you there so it is all about balance to understand how to filter and how to adjust the filter so this is a really uh, important to to understand the balance between filter avoiding and not missing also trend so it's a little bit uh, you know tricky uh, you know but once the the the, the trader comprehend that um, it will be easy for him uh, Russell uh, ES did very well uh, this is I like uh, the two minutes today on the ES it, the last trade really did it. It was um, one, two, and three, and look where is the where it closed that trade. Beautiful, beautiful entry based on the pullback. If you notice, it's not a breakout. It's a base on the uh, support area. You see how when the market was sinking, and the auto trade nailed it. You see, so it's not a breakout. It's not an ATR. It's not a MACD's because it went in sink in to support area bang there we go it's finished based on the pullback re-entry so uh, there is so many different entries on the ti7 that uh, uh, you can cut it and uh, f make the rules uh, the way you want it to be you know if you want to be aggressive conservative scalping swing trading <sighs> It depends what you want to do and uh, this is a one minute 1650 excuse me my voice because you know <clears throat> we put uh, 16 hours work and then at the end of the day when I'm doing the video uh, the bars start dancing you know after a long day and uh, you know so you know we all are human and after 16 hours talking to a million people a day trading uh, directing people uh how you know about the market all this so after 16 hours when i'm doing the video um <clears throat> i'm using the batteries are off i mean they're done for today you know and uh, uh 115 takes one avoided this one because of the filters which you see this is the example uh we missed one here because we have filters and and the filters also avoid sideway market so you, you see where, it's, where, where it is it has to be balanced in another word you cannot tight up too much and you cannot lose it too much but anyway has avoided that trade uh, uh, we missed on, out on that trade because we are using filter but then it took one and two so in another word uh, and look this one here is a small trade uh, but um, this is this is a really acceptable uh, 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 for uh, for the YM as well. Today the YM moved much better than the Nasdaq. And last one is uh, the auto trade uh, signal entry, and uh, this is not the whole day. This is all just uh, based on the last signal. Again, this is not the whole day. It's based on the last entry signal, and. You can see the ES has a mixed signals between long and short indicate there is a weakness uh, on this one here. Immediately you can see the gold, uh, which direction is going. Uh, at the bottom section here, it is a micro account. All of it is based on one contract. And that's why you see $6, $48, $24, $5 because the, this part here is a micro and on the top it is the uh, the uh, the 
like now you can see we got the CL a new signal you can auto trade it and then indicate sell confirming and this mean you have three direction confirming uh, that uh, the CL is gonna go to the right direction so when we are monitoring this one here look at this so this is exactly how you get it on the auto trade and you know immediately you are in the right direction because you have a three different co confirmation in there where on the ES you can see is a mixed market so you can um, you can avoid uh, the the volatility by you know uh, just indicate uh, what's going on and uh, for the uh, Bitcoin lover uh, it is they all uh, had the precise entry and uh, they did the job very well folks that's all what we have and uh, we will see you on the other channel tomorrow live at 10 o'clock eastern time i want to say thank you very much god bless you all and uh, we'll see you tomorrow on the other channel live bye for now